I watched that one eat it. Oh my freaking god. Folks at home, folks at home, welcome back. I'm back out here with Knox Hit. It's been a while, but we're back at Lake Conroe. It's been a little tough recently. We've only been able to catch small ones. Biggest one's probably been like three and a half maybe, but it's been tough getting those bigger fish. Been throwing a swim jig, probably one of the funnest ways to get bit. Um, seeing the fish come from the dock post and eating it. Um, we're just waiting on a big one, and I think today is going to be the day. So stay tuned, because we're going to get a big one today. Right, Knox? Yes, sir. Try to pop her. Oh my freaking god. That scared the crap out of me. That was ferocious. It's not a bad one, if it's even a bass. I think it is a bass. Oh yeah, it's a good one. That's a good one. Well folks, we're about to say, there should be a fish right here. We're fishing some main lake rock. I was literally about to reel this freaking thing in and I was just crazy blow up. I hope I got it on the chest deep. T-boned it. <sighs> not a bad one, not a bad one at all. T-boned it. Oh my freaking god, I wasn't even paying attention. I think it is a better one. Always boat flip, barely hooked fish. Really? In my opinion, I think he should. Better one? Hey. Yeah, I think so. It's a catfish. Freaking kidding me. I hate catfish. You see him down there though? Oh, fuck, thank you. Look at that flathead. Gosh, I saw your rod tip load up. I'm like, yep. Folks at home, folks at home, a little midday update. In the morning, once the, with low light and it was a little cooler, we were trying to fish some main lake stuff that was a little shallower, um, some rock on it. We're trying to do that, 
trying to look a little deeper now as the sun's getting a little higher. It seems like that bite is dying. Um, so we're trying to trying to adjust with the conditions. Um, so we're just trying to trying to stay shallow. Oh, Holy shit, dude! Just missed one. Get a load of this guy. So we're trying to adjust to the conditions. Nox is trying to kill me. Sorry, folks. So stay tuned. Hopefully, we'll be able to figure it out. Um, once we get on docks, I'm pretty sure we'll catch some fish with a swim jig, and Nox is going to flip a Texas rig. And that's a pretty fun bite. So we're trying to figure out what else we can do to catch some fish. It's not always about catching fish. It's how to figure out how to catch more fish, you know? Right, Nox? Yeah. That is so true. Broke me off. That's a big one. We're gonna catch at least one fish off of one of these six docks. Well, I've caught fish today, Knox. Folks at home, folks at home, a little uh, afternoon update. I think it's like 2.30, 3, o'clock, something like that. So we were kind of up shallow in the morning. That bite kind of died on some rock and some uh, hard stuff. And then uh, we tried going a little deeper. That didn't really work out. We never really saw much bait out there. Um, I don't even think we... I don't even think we stopped and fished a single brush pile or rock pile or anything like that. That was off the bank. But we started moving to some docks. It took us a little bit to find out what kind of docks to look for. And then you want to find a certain bait. Uh, today has been the swim jig. I'm kind of kicking Knox's butt right now. I'm sure he doesn't want me to say that, but... I mean, it's like a certified beatdown. I would classify it as this point. It is. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, we're still struggling to find bigger fish up shallow. Knox... Maybe Still getting backlashes, so that seems like it's a good checkpoint. Knox getting a backlash. <laughs> it's very typical of the day so far, so we'll stay tuned. Hopefully we'll catch another big one. Um, I broke one off on a dock. I don't know how big it was, but it's probably a bluegill. Hopefully we'll get a big one. I watched that one eat it. That was cool. Did you really? <laughs> yeah, that was cool. Yeah, every single one of them now. Like we're, we're getting it.
I mean, like, compared to, like, last week or whatever. They were just slapping at last week. Yeah. That is so sick, dude. I saw that one too. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. Oh my freaking god. Dude, something just freaking nailed it. Train wrecked it? I mean, freaking, I mean, I got the, I caught a video of my freaking rod just completely bounced back. Folks at home, folks at home, end of the day report. It's kind of golden hour right now. About to head in. Kind of, kind of struggled the second half of the day. It seems like we always do that. Um, started shallow. It seems like once it got real sunny, the sun came up. And some waves came, shallow bite died. We started to move on to some docks and we caught a pretty good amount of fish, but they were all small. Didn't seem like we could really get anything above three pounds uh, after the morning. So we kind of struggled in that aspect. Right now we're trying to graph some mid depth stuff. Once the sun started getting lower, we, I started to think that the dock bite wasn't gonna be as good. So we started to graph some like little mid, <clears throat> mid depth stuff. And it didn't really work out. Um, so yeah, end of the end of the day on kind of a bad note, but uh, I'm gonna keep the GoPro rolling for the last bit of light. But I'm gonna put the big camera up. So I wanna say thanks for watching. Um, yeah, we had a good day, Knox. You got anything? Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Knox knows what's up. Yeah.